So unless Dick and Hall relents, we won't be able to offer her the position. You think what goes around comes around? That lady is gonna destroy the life of our church. Mark my word. His dog has terminal cancer. Well, I don't need your sympathy. And I sure don't need you telling me what I ought to know about God. She came all the way to our house to pray for your dog, Dad. If Reverend Jenkins decides to pastor again, I'm going wherever she is. God healed Huckleberry. Reverend Jenkins, we would like to kindly invite you to be the pastor of Bible Little Church. And I kindly accept. Say what? Let's bring our churches together. Hit me! Hit me! What's going on? What's going on? Hello, laddie. How are you? Well, what you gonna do? Come in. Hey, I'm back. Thought you might need a little help. I told you, that woman lives to torment me. Did you see the clown? I did, and I'm, I'm sorry to laugh, but <laughs> you just don't know how silly you sound. <laughs> now, Angel, Wait in the car while I go talk to Reverend Jenkins. Oh, no worries, dear. I'll be here. In six months, if the two of you are still here, let's see how silly you sound then. Ah, you have nothing to worry about. I would not miss this wild ride for anything. Angel. Oh, no worries, dear. Yes, it's a glorious day. The birdies are singing. I'll be here. I will. Well, fasten your seatbelt. Because she's on her way in. The ride is about to begin. Pastor Lynn. Pastor? Where is she? Well, she's pounding on the front door. We heard her. Well, what do I do? Do not open that door. What do I do? Let her in. If I open that door, I will not see my first paycheck. Really? See? Good afternoon. What'd you give her time to get out the back door? Goodness, no. Don't be silly. Um, are you by yourself? More or less. Where's Reverend Jenkins? Well, her office is this way. She's not... She's not using that old gone to the restroom ploy, is she? You want me to come down there uh, with you? No. A little help here, please, Pastor McKnight. 
Pastor Lynn, is this going to be part of my job description? Absolutely not. <sighs> Next time I'm going to hide in the men's room. She's never looked there before. <laughs> oh, I'm too old for this. <sighs> Reverend Jenkins, how are you? It's so good to see you again. Knock off the small talk, Mabel. I saw the clown. Please tell me you two were on your way to a birthday party and just decide to stop in here and say hi to Have you no charity for these lost souls? Charity. Charity. Nope, put it on the collection plate. It's gone, been spent. Listen, I think she meant compassion and love. I know what she meant. Look, all I know is one minute I'm home, basking in the wonder of my golden years. And the next minute, I got a pastor, a deacon that hates me, and Bozo the Clown. A clown, Mabel, a clown. Have you no milk of human kindness for me? <laughs> that look never means anything good. I'm sorry, Pastor, but Deacon Hall just drove up. Somebody just go ahead and shoot me. You know what, listen. Let me take care of this. I'll see what I can do, okay? All right. You know what? I'm coming with you. Mabel, you could drive a godly woman to drink. Oh, well, you know, I can help with that. I've got a little something here. I'm kidding, Mabel. Oh. Just you make me crazy. Well, okay, okay. <clears throat> Reverend Jenkins, I wouldn't be here if I weren't at the end of my rope. On any day, my clients run a desperation level between eight to 10 on a 10 point scale. And then sometimes I get a 15. Which is where I've always come in. <sighs> Lynn. We've done all we can do. You've always been able to help in these situations. You're a miracle worker. But Mabel, here's the thing. Yes, we're the church. Called to help, called to good works. But if we don't have a proper placement for the folks you send us, we can do more harm than good. Seems to me that'd be a violation of, what, placement 101? I get your point. But the, the next place from here is the streets. I don't think that'll do no harm. Let me come at this from a different direction. I've been pastor for less than a month. We've just beginning our honeymoon. Haven't even really smooched. And yet, here you are. With a clown! Well, I aim to please. 